Hello and welcome to the second news bulletin from the Hanover Trade Fair. Today you will find out what Phoenix Contact has to offer at the Wind Lead Trade Fair and how Tech2U inspires young people for technical professions. We will also be reporting on the conclusion of a cooperation agreement between Phoenix Contact and Eaton. But first of all, something new for all installation professionals. In building installation, limited space is often an issue. Benefit from the advantages of the new installation terminal blocks with pit connection. The new pit I insulation terminal blocks from Phoenix Contact are tailored exactly to the requirements of building automation. Therefore, that means a very compact design, easy neutral conductor disconnection, a large area marking of every terminal point. Of course, it is also possible to test at each individual terminal point. The best part, of course, is the pit connection which is now available in the components for building installation, which means tool-free wiring here as well. Phoenix Contact Component Housings make the assembled PCB a shock and dirt-proof electronics module. Now you obtain the matching PCB terminal block with push-in technology for the Series ME and ME Max electronics housings. The FKDSO is a new push-in spring connection for our ME and ME Max housings. It's available in two, three and four positions and you can connect wires from 0.2 to 2.5 square millimeters. Electrical devices are getting smaller and smaller. That's why it helps when the pre-assembled M12 flush type connectors can be easily screwed onto your device from the outside. Phoenix Contact offers a complete new product range which meets the requirements of the complete encoder industry. The system, the modular system, is an M12 contact insert and a square flange. The square flange is compatible to all existing encoder systems. For modular systems you can use a special pre-assembled M12 contact insert which you can clip into the back of the flange. Increase your power and signal quality with surge protection. A new lightning protection power package sets new worldwide standards. Our power trap is really a rugged type 1 arrestor. It fulfills the highest requirements for surge protection. It's possible to use this arrestor up to 4,000 meters. The test with 25G is fulfilled regarding to shock and vibrations. And this arrestor is also possible to be installed in grids up to 960 volts AC. For a special arrestor, for example, for wind turbine applications or big industrial grids. Energy data acquisition is the basis for operational energy management. Now you can obtain new network capable measuring devices and complete data logger packages from Phoenix Contact. With the energy measuring devices in short called MPRO, currents, voltages and frequencies are measured and monitored. The new device family ranges from the communication professional to the easy compact starter for the DIN rail. With the pluggable communication modules, an easy integration into already existing network structures and field bus systems is achieved. Via a keystroke, the measured values can easily be monitored for an on-site analysis and via the web server function, this can be easily done from the control room. For an easy and efficient data acquisition, we offer our customers two different data logger kits. The basic version consists of a compact controller with some IOs and an antenna. Every change in status is sent via SMS or email. And the flex version, it allows modular expansion and data is directly written into an SQL database. Both kits can be set up by customers without any programming knowledge. Eaton and Phoenix Contact signed a cooperation agreement on Monday here at the Hanover Trade Fair. Two innovations. The first is the technology for the Contactron electronic motor starter from Phoenix Contact. And the second is the Smart Wire DT technology from Eaton, which is a combination that significantly simplifies control cabinet installation for the industry. Today, Phoenix Contact and Eaton took a very important strategic step. We signed a partnership in the fields of Phoenix Contact Contactron and Eaton's Smart Wire DT. We both are convinced that this will be a major step forward also for our customers. 
When it comes to control wiring and load wiring, this is a huge customer benefit and we hope for great success. Inspiring young people for technology. That is the idea behind the tech to you initiative at the Hanover Trade Fair. A good reason for a Phoenix contact to be there as well. Here at the tech to you booth, we hand out information to future apprentices. For that, we use Wii, with which you can be part of an interactive rowing contest. You can fly a drone, buy an iPad. It's just a lot of fun, and we hope that we draw some benefits out of it. We had a lot of recognition so far. Phoenix Contact gets roughly 800 students here by bus, and the future apprentices will be here today as well. For the second time, Phoenix Contact is showing components and systems for the wind power industry here at the Lee Trade Fair. The focus is on innovative solutions for control technology, monitoring, and surge protection. Here on our booth, we show innovative solutions for the trend topics that are subject of discussions in the wind energy industry. These are components and systems for long time availability, possibilities for plant diagnostics, and reduced engineering times for automation and wind turbine safety. Among these, the new Type 1 Arresta Power Trap, our lightning monitoring system LMS, the new high speed IO system Axioline, the Profinet integration with the new Tiger chip. And finally, our software construction kit for wind turbine operations. More than 16 tons of ink, more than 1,300 tons of paper, and more than 4,000 pages produced in 15 languages, and more than 900,000 copies. The new catalog of Phoenix Contact is stacked onto 1,600 pallets and 48 truckloads, distributed it all over the world. Well, I got my copy today. Thank you, Zilke. You can get your copy on the internet from your contact person. I read this tonight. See you tomorrow.